My name is Daryl Belfry. We're here at Hertz Arena in Estero, Florida, and we're going to teach some hockey today. The one thing you have to acknowledge is you can't run a drill and teach at the same time. You're doing one or the other. So if you're going to run the drill, you need other people who are going to do the teaching. Because when you're going worried about the start and the stop of the repetition, you're worried about how it flows, whether they're doing the right things. If you're consumed with those things, you're just not going to be able to teach. So if you want to teach, you have to find ways to release yourself from the operation of the drill. So we're going to have one guy with a puck. Now that guy always needs to be a different color than the two guys who are going to get it. And it's gonna be up to you, it's gonna be up to you guys to organize that in the line. I am not gonna be deciding who goes next. You guys have to figure it out. What are the rules surrounding who goes next? Oh, uh, the colors, so the two guys have to be the same color, and then the other one has to be a different color. Love it, okay, are we ready? Okay. Nice! That was a sick hook steal. Good. Yes, work together. Love it. That's it. What do you got? That's perfect. Really well done. Good job. So first off, great job setting up the colors. I love that. The less I have to do that, the better I like it, okay? Listen, do I need to be this guy? How can you get me out of this? How, how, how can you arrange this? Skating out? So no, like I don't want to dump the puck in. Oh. So I want to change, who, sh who should do it? The second guy in line. Second guy. Okay. Here we go. So the part of the teaching part here is to give them some independence over the drill. They're running it and I just back out of it and let them kind of do what they're going to do. I'm also looking for like self-corrections where they're talking to each other. I love when they get excited for someone else too. I love that. So right now it's not, I've done the teaching. There's no need for me to be barking at them all the time. They can just do it on their own. See how they're organizing it? Perfect. So they know to go get the pucks all on their own. They're gonna reset up the drill and I don't, need to, I don't need to be involved in that. I can now start talking to kids and doing all this stuff. I can Love pass. It. You can pass? Perfect. Yep. See how they, uh, they organize it themselves now? Comes over and says, hey, I can be the passer for you, coach. How cool is that? Drop the puck, let's go.